How did you earn the success so early in your career? So I was five, okay? And I was at an HEB in Texas, which is a grocery store, and I put a nickel into one of those little machines that either spits out a slappy hand that sticks on the wall or some bubble gum or a fake tattoo. And the one that I got was a little plastic Easter egg of success. Hey, it's Matt. This is a speed interview session with a goat. Come on, let's go. Keep up. Back up. Back up. Come on. You're going to be on film. This is an interview. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. They're probably going to try to eat the microphone cable. Okay. Let's start with Gogo. You seem the most interested. Gogo. Hi. How are you? Have you been eating well today? Great. Lily. Hello, Lily. Are you good? How many horns do you have? That's great, too. Good, good. Hi, Coco. You want to talk? Tallulah, my favorite goat. Say hi to everyone. Yeah, do you want to talk about how you're feeling? I feel the same. Here, give me a hug. Give me a hug. Okay. Those are the goats. Check it out real quick. Give you a tour. There's a goat house. Built that one. The goats eat hay. Uh, this is an old climbing wall. Designated goats. That's a ramp I built for goats. And uh, there's some more wood for goats. Goats like to rub their heads on things, so I put an old broom. The sweeping portion of a broom? What would that be, the broom? Uh, that's where they can rub their heads and stuff. And then over here we got a little curveball. <laughs> we'll check this out later when we do a duck interview. This is a duck house in progress here. Modeled after the goat house. The goat house. And this is going to be a duck run. Okay, ducks really don't run. But we call it a duck run, okay? Thanks for joining us. If you want to look down, we got some goats eating my stuff. But ladies, I love you. Thank you for being a part of my first interview um, with with goats. Okay, good night. Matthew Deer Show. 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 Is this a square? Uh, I just see a white card. <laughs> it's an image of a dog. Champagne. 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 I'm champagne, I feel great, cause I work with a man, and I like to take your things out. The interview went so well, we have a goat that's tried to follow us out, Lily, you met earlier. We're going to get Lily back We're in the pen now. Okay, Lily, Lily, come on. I know, but the world's better out there, I know. But we're, we're going back, they're all coming up. They're all coming up. We got Lily and Tallulah back in, but now we got Go-Go out. We're going to get Go-Go back in. Let's go, Go-Go. Let's go, Go-Go. Come on, Go-Go. She's making me look bad. Hey there, Lily. Go-Go. You ready? Is this a standoff? Can we go back in the, in your home? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. That was an interview with a goat with Matthew Deer. Thank you for joining us. You've got me thinking I'm not as good at thinking as I thought I was. Thought I was. You've got me thinking I'm not as good at thinking as I thought I was. Thought I was.
painting, too many painting, too many painting with my pink tear. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. I'm set. And it's Pam. Pamorama. Kind of like, you know, Pamorama bar. Mine's with Pam. I guess they're saying they dance so hard they're not even dancing. They're just standing. Yeah, I'm the one that declared it instant prayer. Oops, my head just fell off. It's brand new paint. It's expensive. As much as I'd like to waste it right now, I just can't. Mm -mm. We got about a minute and 15 seconds left. Here we go. Mm. That was two-minute painting. Let me hold it up here. It came together last minute. I didn't think I was gonna have it. I'm out of breath. For two minutes, I'm happy with that. For two minutes. Challenge yourself. Challenge yourself. Challenge yourself. Challenge yourself. Challenge yourself. It's Matt. This year we started a forest school, so we do a lot of fun activities uh, outside in nature. And I'll show you right now how to make a wood cookie person out of some frosted hawthorn that I salvaged and some sticks from the ground. Step one, cut the body circle. Nothing fancy, just my hand as a vise. That's our body. Next, cut the headpiece. There's our cute little head for the wood uh, creature. Fair warning, don't try this at home. It's a neck hole, armhole one, armhole 7.2, leg hole, eyewear is important, you won't get sawdust in your eyes, leg hole number two. Now for the head, just need one hole for the neck. Pick your chin. I like this little area here because it looks kind of like a natural uh, face shape, lucked out with that one. 
So I'm gonna put the neck right here. All right, so I've got my pieces now for the uh, extremities, the, the neck, the uh, two arms and the legs, and let's put it together. And there you have it, a cute little wood person with feet. That's where you can get creative. Say hi. All right, guys. Yeah. Now we're going to go play. Me and my buddy. Pony hat there. Yeah, oh, there you put it in the back part. This is real. Getting used to it now. You feel me?